Hello. Hello. Hola. Konnichiwa. Welcome aboard and thanks for flying with Delta. Muchas gracias por volar con Delta. Our first priority on every flight, on every flight, is safety. So before we depart, we'll be giving a brief safety presentation. Okay. Be sure all carry-on items are securely stowed in an overhead bin and place smaller items under the seat in front of you. And ensure all aisles, exits, and bulkhead areas are clear. If you're seated at an emergency exit, please review the responsibilities for emergency exit seating on the back of the safety information card, which is in your seat pocket. Are you willing and able to assist with the operation of the exit if necessary? Yes. yes. If you're unable to perform these functions, please let us know and we'll be happy to find you another seat. As we leave the gate, make sure your seatbelt is fastened. To fasten, insert the metal tip into the buckle and adjust the strap so it's low and tight across your lap. To release the belt, just lift the top of the buckle. Please remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened. Anytime the seatbelt sign is on, and even if the sign is off, please keep your seatbelt fastened in case we experience unexpected rough air. For everyone's safety, Federal regulations require all passengers to comply with the posted placards and lighted information signs located throughout the cabin. In addition to any crew member's instructions, smoking, including the use of e-cigarettes, is not allowed on any Delta flight. And federal law also prohibits tampering with, disabling, or destroying a resting smoke detector. There are eight exits on this plane. Four doors, two on each side, and four window exits over the wings. Each door has a detachable side that can be used as a raft. An additional raft is located in a compartment near the front of the plane. All exits are clearly marked with an exit sign. However, if there is a loss of power and cabin visibility is reduced, lights will illuminate the aisle to guide you to an exit. Please take a moment to find the exits closest to you. And remember, they might be behind you. It's unlikely, but if cabin pressure changes, the panels above your seat will open, revealing oxygen masks. If this happens, reach up and pull a mask toward you until the tube is fully extended. Place the mask over your nose and mouth. Slip the elastic strap over your head and breathe normally. And note that oxygen is flowing. So don't worry if the bag does not inflate. Be sure to adjust your own mask before helping others. A water evacuation is also unlikely, but just in case. Life is allocated under your seats in the main cabin. If you're seated in the first class or business class cabin, Life is located either in a compartment beneath or adjacent to your seat. To use, remove the vest from its container by pulling on the tab and then opening the pouch. Slip the vest over your head. Wrap the strap around your waist and attach it to the buckle in front. As you leave the plane, inflate the vest by pulling down on the red tabs at the bottom of the vest, or manually inflate it by blowing into the tubes at shoulder level. You can activate a light by pulling down on the tab in front, but if your vest doesn't have a tab, the light will activate automatically in the water. If this plane features Wi-Fi, then internet can be accessed by using our GoGo -Go internet service. Now, before we take off, be sure your seat is upright, your eye lamp rests are lowered, your tray table is put away, and all carrying items are properly stored. And finally, now would be a good time for everyone to review the safety information card which is in your seat pocket. On behalf of everyone at Delta Airlines, we'd like to thank you for paying attention. Now, as we prepare for takeoff, please relax and enjoy the flight. Thank you for flying with Delta.